Hey guys, you're on the lot with Stephen Hill here at Jaguar Land Rover West Houston and wanted to show off this wireless mic that I just bought and see if it works. So check it out. All right, so I've already unwrapped it and I'll show you some photos of where I bought it from on Amazon. And um, it'll come in a case like this with a few extra, um, like an extra clip and an extra cover for the mic. Um, so you get this one piece right here, which I'm using um, this USB-C to charge. And then they also give you a cord this little bitty cord right here, they'll actually fit the microphone and charge the mic. So I'm charging it up right now. I'm gonna go out and just do kind of a, a walk around of this Range Rover Sport that I got an internet lead on. So anyway, I'm not using the mic now. I'll have the mic on next time we uh, we come back. We're doing a guest appearance by David Brewer. Hi, Dave. <laughs> He's gonna help me to do a video connecting this to my phone to show you how it works. All right, here we go. All right. So um, this piece right here, you just click it into the bottom of your iPhone. Oh, and I found you gotta take the case off. It's not long enough to go unless you take the case off. So you gotta put the clip in there. And then on the um, lapel mic, where's it at? You push this little button right here, and there's a green light. Where's it at? Oh, the battery's dead. Oh, there's, so there's a little green light right there. If you see the green light, it's paired up, and you can just put the little microphone on your lapel, and you're ready to roll. It's that easy. All right, so I'm testing out the uh, mic now. I'm outside, and I'm going to get a little bit further away from the camera. So normally you couldn't hear what I'm saying if I was um, videoing with my um, phone right there. But anyway, let me tell you about this one. It's a 2019 Range Rover Sport Autobiography has about 13,000 miles on it, and it's the uh, 5.0 liter V8 with an Eaton supercharger on top, puts out 518 horsepower, and it's um, the Santorini black, and it's got the pimento interior, so the red interior. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the phone and walk around like I normally do. Um, normally I'm using uh, my earbuds as my microphone. I'm gonna see how this works and see if it's any different. Let's check it out. All right, now I'm just holding the uh, camera in my hand, and I've got the mic on, and um, this is a 2019 Range Rover Sport Autobiography. It um, has about 13,000 miles on it. Check it out. So it's Santorini Black, has the um, black letters and grill, blacked out wheels. I believe those are the 22s. Let's check it out. Yeah, they're the 22s. Looks really good. We're selling this one at 98998, 13,476. I'll get the exact miles when we're inside. So the autobiography has the nicest materials and the biggest engine, which is really nice. You can see the dual exhausts right there. Super clean car. You can kind of see the metallic coming out on the Santorini black with the sun on it. All right, let's check out the inside. I always like to point out the uh, blind spot, keyless entry. There's a beautiful pimento and ebony interior. And if you look, you can see the Union Jack embossed in the seats, letting everyone know that it's a British-made automobile. And let's check out the mileage. It's uh, 13,511. I'm going to fire it up. You see all the capacitive switches on the steering wheel. has adaptive cruise control, the driver nanny, heated steering wheel. It's got 39 miles to wear out of gas, so we'll be fine. I'll hit OK to clear that. And then you have your um, Touch Pro Duo, so you have your Nav Media phone, and you can set up your CarPlay or your Android Auto. Bottom screen is going to be your uh, vehicle, uh, the seats for the heated and air conditioned seats. There you go. And the vehicle terrain response, so you have your um, dynamic, eco, comfort, grass, gravel, snow. When you hit them, it tells you. You don't have to memorize this. Mud ruts, sand, and rock crawl. Hill descent's on for some reason. I'll turn that off so I may push the button. And then um, just drive, reverse, get your camera, and park. Hidden compartment here, store your sunglasses, or in Texas, maybe your pistol. Right in there, see how deep that is. The Brits don't think we should have cup holders, so they have cover for it right there. And you've got the refrigerator under the armrest right here. It's optional, but this one's got it, which is pretty cool. No pun intended. 
and you have your upper glove box, and your lower glove box, and these are both lockable. You just go into valet mode. Pick a four digit number you can remember after dinner, not out of the town. And now it's locked, so um, these won't open. The um, screen's locked out, radio's locked out, and the um, trunk in the back won't open either. Then you get back in, remember what number you made up that day, and you're back alive again. All right, let's go check out the back seat. All right, so the back seat's just like the front. You have your air controls for the back, so you can turn the fan down a little bit. Power outlets. It's got the click and button go bases here. This one's actually got a um, hanger for your jacket. Big panel roof. Super clean car in and out. It's got the Meridian upgraded sound system. Let's check out the trunk. So it is the autobiography. Still has the original carpeted mats back here and the um, sun visor. This is a little cover to hide your purchases. All right, let's hit the button and close it. We've got a guest appearance by Aaron. Aaron might be selling this one. He's coming to get the key from me right now. I don't know. Do you sell it? Okay. Still available. <laughs> All right, let's raise the hood. So I like to show everyone that it has these snorkels under the hood. So um, the air actually comes in here, up through the hood, and then back down into the snorkels, into your air intakes. And this car is able to go through almost three feet of water. So um, makes it very, very capable, um, both on-road and off, as far as the suspension and the um, amount of water you can go through. And then this is the Eaton Supercharger, right on top of a 5.0 liter V8. This car puts out 518 horsepower. Let's go and shut her down. All right, guys, so that's the uh, 2019 Range Rover Sport Autobiography, Santorini Black, with the ebony and pimento interior. Uh, please take a moment, like, and uh, follow my channel, and um, share with your friends, and watch it about 10 times. Thanks.